Hi everyone, this is your math guru. In this video, I'm going to show you how to solve the following math puzzle box. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for solutions to more math puzzles. The puzzle contains the numbers 1 to 9. Each column and each row add up to the number given outside the boxes. We have to put the correct number in each box to complete the addition equation without repeating any number. The first point to note is we are not going to repeat any number that is from the numbers 1 to 9. So the first step is to strike out all the numbers used already in the box. We have 1, we have 2, we have 4, and we have 8. We are left with 3, 5, 6, 7, and 9. To solve the puzzle, we've been told that the number in each or the numbers in each column or row add up to the number outside the box. So what it means is if I add the first row, the value will be 15. So therefore, starting with the first column on from my right, I'm going to add 2 plus 1 plus a missing value. I should have a 12. So therefore, I'm going to replace the missing box with the variable x. Writing my equation, I have 2 plus 1 plus x equals to 12. I have 3 plus x, that's equals to 12. And using the balance method, I'm going to take out 3 from both sides. What I'm left with is 3 minus 3, that's 0. I'm left with x equals 12 minus 3, that's 9. So what that means is, for my missing box, the value is 9. The next box, I will go with the middle row. As shown, the value must add up to 10. I'm going to replace my missing box with x. So therefore, I have x plus 4 plus 1 equals to 10. I have x plus 5 equals to 10. This is the balance method. If I take out 5 from both sides, what I have left is x plus 0, which is x, equals 10 minus 5, which is 5. So therefore, my missing value for the box is 5. The next step, I'm going to take the first column as shown. The numbers added together must give me 20. So going back to my calculations, I have the missing number x such that my x plus 5 plus 8 is equal to 20. I have x plus 5 plus 8, that's 13 equals to 20. Taking out 13 from both sides is in the balance method. I'm left with x plus 0, 13 minus 13 is 0. So x equals 20 minus 13, that's 7. So therefore, my missing variable is 7. Note that if I go back to the listed numbers, I've been able to find 9, I've used 5 and 7. I'm left with 3 and 7. Remember, we are not to repeat any numbers. So therefore, using the first row at the top, the numbers must add up to 15. My missing variable or number will be x. So therefore, what I have is, I have 7 plus x plus 2 equals 15. I have 9 plus x, that's 7 plus 2 is 9, is 15. Is in the balance method, I take out 9 from both sides. I'm left with 0 plus x, that's x equals 15 minus 9, that's 6. So therefore, my missing variable for the first row is 6. If you look at the listed numbers, I'm left with the number 3. But I'm going to do a double check 
to see that my answer is correct. If I had the column in the middle, I should have 6 plus 4 plus 3, and that will give us 6 plus 4, 10, 10 plus 3, 13, as should. Thanks for watching. Bye.